told me this is our Space Trucker Jazz Band from Outer Space that all four of us have played in at one time or another called the Moon Raiders. He also plays in a band called Say Darling with uh, the uh, incredible Celia Woodsmith. Uh, they're playing here Thanksgiving weekend on this stage for your viewing and listening pleasure. So you should come back to that. That's Chris Hirsch. Give it up for This is uh, this next song is an old song. Any uh, well, any Lonesome Draw fans? Okay. So this used to be a uh, sad uh, country folk song. Nash Riley back there in the back played a real mean pedal steel on this. Yeah. Song. And uh, inspired by that, we took it and turned it into a country song called "Put It Together." <laughs> Oh, the 
啊，放心。This next song is called You Can Turn It Off. It's about being stressed. <laughs> My brother Tom, who played drums on one of the songs on this album, described this as the pot pit of the summer. <laughs> And I'm sticking with that. Sexy song now. It's probably your lovers out there. Oh. Where were you when I was recording this? I needed that. So 
song's called Let the Lightning. Uh, so I used to, I used to, um, I used to come into the city 
every Monday night to play at this open mic that Tom Bianchi, who booked the show, in Holt. And um, I would drive in and I would stay until it ended at like one in the morning. And then sometimes my girlfriend at the time, Kendra, would let me stay at her house. And sometimes I would drive all the way back to my hometown and then go to work with Brian the next day. And then we would go get drunk at lunch. <laughs> but this was like, I was like, this is my best song in 2012. So this is my best song in 2012. I play it every time. And uh, it's called Hold Me Down. It's a coin flip, if I remember all the lyrics or not. So cut me some slack if I don't. That I couldn't see. Well, my bare feet are soaking up the Kentucky blue earth, and scripture don't save me now. So lay me down easy on the grass in the backyard. In the spring, yet, yeah. Sunday, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> 
Any fans of the Wood Brothers out there? Postcards from Hell it means a whole hell of a lot to me. I played it with my friends and cousin Bobby, <laughs> Nash, Owen, Steve. Hey guys. Hey Steve. Sorry I'm cheating on you guys tonight. <laughs> uh, it's cool. Hello Steve. <laughs> Alright, this song's called Postcards from Hell. <laughs>
cockroach You can't wait to die If you ask him How he sang the blues so well He says I got a soul cross I got a soul cross I got a soul
sticking around. Uh, this, we're going to kind of continue on, interspersing the album songs throughout the night. Uh, this is the title track of the album. The song's called Bend and Hold. The album's called Bend and Hold. And we're just going to do it.
Uh, this next tune, um, Tyler Childers fans up there? Yeah. Yeah. There he is. <laughs> um, so two things about this song. Tyler wrote this song for his friend Cody. And uh, <clears throat> Cody had a grandma who would take care of all of Tyler and his shitty friends when they were growing up. Learn how to play music and get in trouble and, you know, kind of gave him a safe haven, a place to express themselves and play music and, and learn all of that. And uh, when she died, he wrote the song for her. And I think everybody on the stage and everybody who plays music or does art of any kind has someone in their life like that who just kind of let them do what they wanted to without any judgment. And uh, that's what this song is about. It's called I Will Follow You to Virgin. I might play it.
Ah, uh, cool. Hi, Amanda. Amanda Connolly is here. She she is by far the person I've known the longest. We we met in third grade playing Connect Four. <laughs> And now she's here at my show. <laughs> this song's about small towns. <laughs>
David Andrew Morgan on the drums. He brought his mallets just for me. You know, this is a lot of fun. A lot of fun. Um, it's crazy. I mean, Amanda, you're here. But like, I got friends I met in Somerville, you know, these fucking people. I got hometown friends, I got college friends, the friends who show up at my house all the time and help me make them dinner. Karen, hi. I got work friends, secret work friends. Uh, but yeah, it's just, you know, it's fucking wild that you can bring people together by doing this. And I love all of you very much, and I'm so happy to be here. Thank you. This next song is called Soul of the Song. And there's a line in it where I go, And all that I need is the soul of the song and the woman I love, Hana Lamar. That is about my beautiful wife, Kendra, humming along to that Tyler Children's song we played. So how about that? This is like a sentimental bluegrass song on the album. But I got these guys here, so we're gonna do a country song. <laughs> Oh, yeah. 
Paul, get your charge. Just see your reminder.
Big round of applause for Paul Chase on the video. If you go see the show in the South Shore, there's a 97% chance that Paul's playing in sport. <laughs> Give it up for David and Andrew Moore on the drums. Dave plays an excellent jazz jam called the Arcanauts that you should check out. It's incredible. It's a lot of fun to listen to. Where's that? It's a ghetto. Uh, and Chris Hirsch on the guitar. Guitars, man. Uh, Uh, Chris plays in the Moon Raiders, obviously. Chris Hirsch in the Moon Raiders. If you're in, the, in any of the country you play tonight, you can really get down in the Moon Raiders. And uh, if you're in an excellent rock and roll, check out Sam Arnold. Yeah. We got eight minutes, so we're gonna try and make this song take eight minutes. Yeah. It's called Singing a Different Tune. On the album, there's 13 tracks of Chris Hirsch, and I made him promise to replicate that in the solo tonight. <laughs> Seriously though, thank you all for coming out. I love you all. Thank you, Amelia, to Joyce for doing the sound. It sounds incredible. Whatever you're tipping your bartenders, it's not enough. I promise. They've had a really fucking hard year and a half. Treat them well, make them feel welcome. And uh, we're gonna we're gonna do this, we're gonna get out of here. Oh, yeah. 
Yes, I can be sure. I still know nothing as I did before. And I've been taught to fight. I've tried so hard in vain to figure out how to live with this. To figure out how to live